YouTube, it's your girl Talisha Shantuan and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It will be greatly appreciated. I focus mainly on fashion, lifestyle, and a little bit of beauty here and there. So if that's what you're into, definitely hit the subscribe button and even that notification bell and you will know every time I post. I'm doing a little bit of everything. I have Ivy Park, Express, Target, Fashion Nova. If you want to see it, it's probably going to be in this haul. So if that's what you're interested in, definitely stay tuned. All right, so the first thing that I want to start off with are accessories. I only got two accessories, and they are both from Target. Um, the first thing that I got was is this bucket bag. It is a cream color. Yeah, I'm going to say cream. It's cream. The hardware on it is gold. It has this little hand strap. I love it. I think that it is so freaking cute. Like, it is just the perfect size. I just think that this bucket bag is perfect. Um, it also came with a strap, like a shoulder strap that you can also put on the bag. But yeah, it comes with a shoulder bag, a shoulder strap as well. So you can wear the, the bag down by your side. I think this thing is so cute. It has the drawstring so that you can cinch it in. You can fit so much stuff in this. And guess what? I got this thing on clearance. I think I paid, I think the regular price was, well, I thought I had the price on it. I think the regular price of it was like $36 and I got it for like $25. Um, it was on clearance. And I know that the only reason why it was on clearance is because of this color. It's not really con considered a fall color, I guess, in stores, but it is. Like you can definitely carry this in the fall like with some bad boots like i definitely can see this i love this bag and like i said i got it from target so check your target and see if it's still if they still have this um but it was on clearance so it may not be in there but i mean try it look you never know also i got this bag as well this bag is like the um the the faux version of the Bottega Bottega veneta bag it has like that poofy um, effect to it. It's good for like carrying it under your shoulder like this. Um, it has plenty of room. I've already carried it. I have my things inside of it. Um, this strap is definitely detachable, so you can put the strap inside. You know, you don't have to carry the strap at all, but I'll just put it inside the bag so that you can see um, what it looks like. And that is what the bag pretty much looks like. It looks like that. I think it's cute. You can definitely throw this on with anything. Um, and I mean, <laughs> you can't beat this little bag. I got this from Target. I think I paid for this bag 20, it might've been like 20, it might've been $28. I think it was 20, $28. Um, but I mean, I think it's a cute bag. It's pretty much falling in line with what's going on in fashion right now target definitely be up on it i mean they're a little overpriced but target is definitely up on it on what's in style right now so i picked up this bag which i love as well so let's go ahead and get into these clothes all right so the first item that i'm going to show today is going to be this it's like the cat suit from fashion nova i'm pretty sure you have seen this all over your instagram feed Every girl has this cat suit from Fashion Nova. Um, I really do like it. My only complaint is it is super stretchy. Like super, super, super stretchy. I could have went down probably two sizes. I got a medium in this because I knew it was going to be stretchy. And I probably could have got an extra small just so that it would fit and not give me this saggy crotch area that I keep getting. So I keep having to pull it up. But I guess that it will do until I can get a smaller size in it. I really like it. It doesn't seem to be very see-through. It's very stretchy, like I said. I like it because the straps are not spaghetti straps, but the straps are thick enough so that I can hide my bra strap. I follow um, Brie, but she had this exact 
outfit on from Fashion Nova, and she paired it with this puffer jacket from Zara, and I was in love. So I had to get it as well. I freaking love this outfit. I love this coat. It's like um, it's like a faux leather material. It's nude. It has like the the buttons are covered in like the faux leather material as well, so it doesn't show up silver. But there's silver on the inside. Um, I got this in a size double XL, I do believe, because that's what the Zara app told me to to get, which I'm cool with it. It's it's pretty cool. Um, I probably could have went down to just an extra large. But I mean, the double eight sale is cool too. But I like it. It's, it's waist length. It's not very long, but it's just like your typical puffer. I freaking love this coat. And I cannot wait for it to get cold because I want to wear her. Like, I want to wear her. And she's lined in the inside. Like, this is thick. This is going to keep you warm. I'm with it. I, I, I love her. I, I love her. This is my Zara outfit coat that I thought would look really nice with my um my Fashion Nova um one piece outfit so yeah actually the only thing that we're going to be talking about is the top that I got from Fashion Nova as well um it's a rib material it has it's a real turtleneck I like it it's very fitted it's a top it's not a bodysuit but it is very 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 fitted um, I like how it just easily tucks down in the pants. I don't have to worry about it coming out of the pants. Um, I just paired it with these black pants because I thought that it would look really nice with these black pants. It's a really soft um, rib material, like I said. It comes all the way down to my hands, which I like. I hate when shirts kind of cut off a little bit too short on my wrist. That drives me nuts. I like this. I think it's very flattering on the body. It's a very nice nude tan color, which you can really put with anything. You can even throw this on with a pair of jeans. And yeah, I got this shirt in a size large, I do believe, which I'm happy with it. But it is very, very, very stretchy. Um, but I'm happy with the size large. Oh, and if anybody is worried, wondering where I got these um bedroom shoes from i got these from amazon they are so freaking soft and so freaking comfortable i love 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 these slippers but i will have them linked down below in the description box as well as well as everything that i try on in this haul it's all gonna be linked below down in the description box so yeah um again this is from fashion nova all right so for the next fit i have here is a little bit of it's a combination of items from different stores i have the bodysuit from zara it's, it's that really silky smooth material very 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 stretchy i got it in this um it's like a pinky nude color um i like the way the the sleeves right here the straps kind of go in only thing is, is it shows my bra so i probably would have to wear um a strapless bra so that you can't see them or i also have those little clips where you can clip the straps together in the back which will pull them in um up here so that you wouldn't be able to see them um it does kind of show the bra a little bit on the side because it is kind of a low cut right here on the side but I still like this. It's getting cold outside, so there's a good chance I probably won't wear it just like this outside because it's gonna be cold. So I'm gonna have to wear a blazer, some kind of jacket coat over it. Um, but I really do like this um, bodysuit. It is very, very, very stretchy as well. I got this in a size large. I definitely could have went down to a size medium. Um, like I said in my previous Zara haul, um, I'm new to Zara. This is only my second time I'm getting items from Zara. So I'm new. I'm just now trying to figure out what sizes I wear in Zara clothes. Um, but I definitely could have went down the size of this because this is very stretchy. And I don't need all of this room. I like for the items to fit, I like a bodysuit especially, to fit snug on me. Um, but this is the back of the bodysuit. Um, I think it's very, very, very cute. Um, I want to say this bodysuit was probably about $19.90, I want to say. 
Um, and they came in so many different colors. It came in black, white, um, this this color. I think it came in like a, a purple color. So many colors to choose from. Um, a khaki color. Like, I really like that khaki color. But yeah, um, definitely check that out on the website or if you have a Zara store near you, which I do not. I'm so jealous. But yeah, I paired this bodysuit with these joggers, these faux leather joggers that I actually got from Target. I love these joggers. It has a working um, drawstring, so I can stitch in the waist um, like I did um, for these pants. Only thing is, is, I just wish these pants were a little bit longer. I don't know if you guys can see, but they're just not quite long enough but it's cool um i'm sure i'll probably wear these with boots um you do have the option to wear the pants leg up i do know that some people like that style not really my style i like them down but i don't know it just depends on what kind of shoes that i wear with these um pants but i really really like them there i didn't expect target to have these and they were only 20 dollars and Target had them in this black color. They had them in like a nude color, like a like a real nude. They also had them in like this burnt orange kind of color, which I thought was really, really, really cute. All for $20. Like you cannot beat that. Um, everybody is wearing these pants. Um, they are kind of a high waist. So yeah, if you are into these pants definitely check these out at target i got these in a size large which is like my normal size um so yeah this is that outfit i really do like this i think this is a very cute cute fit very cute fit and so yeah all right so the next item that i have is this hoodie from target i got it in a cream color um i got this hoodie in like a double xl because they didn't have an extra large. I wanted an extra large because I did want that oversized look. But this is very oversized. But I'm actually cool with it. Um, it's not too, too, too bad. Um, so I do like it. Um, it is supposed to be more like of a waist length. But because I got it so oversized, it is a little bit longer. Which is cool too. Um, it has like a big hood on it. Not that I would wear the hood. But I do like things that have hoods on them. So I actually got it in a like a brown gold color, which I really, really, really love. I got this one in the size that I want. I got this in an extra large. And I like the way this one fits better. But, I mean, I still like this hoodie. I think this hoodie was $20 a piece as well. Um, It has like those puff balloon kind of sleeves on them and cinched in at the wrist but i love this one as well um i actually have already worn this i wore this with um the black and gold jordan retro jordan sixes um that came out and it was like a perfect match for them so i did wear them with this i'm not sure i probably wear this with a pair of boots um some brown boots or something like that um or probably some sneakers but yeah but yeah, I did get these. I love both of these. These both came from Target. Like I said, I believe that they were about $20. If I can still find all of these items online, I'll be sure to link them down below. All right, so the next item that I have is this sweater. Um, it is very a deep V sweater. But I like this sweater. It came from J Lux Label. This is the first time I've gotten something from J Lux Label. I've had heard like good and bad reviews from JLux label um but i actually like this sweater um it's it's a crop top sweater um it has like those balloon sleeves as well um like i said it's cropped but i really do like this sweater it's a very soft sweater material i love this color gray like it's hunter green it's perfect it's not faded i don't know how it will do after you wash it but I really, really, really like it for fall. It's the perfect green for fall. Um, it's actually pretty warm, believe it or not. Like I can feel it keeping like the heat in on me. Um, and I am looking in the mirror over here. But I do like this sweater. I think it's very, very, very cute. It has a deep V in the back as well with a little strap that kind of holds the 
sleeves up on your body. And I think that is very cute and very sexy. And I just paired it with these faux leather pants that I tend to pair everything with. But I think these are cute and you can't go wrong with a green sweater and some faux leather pants. So that's this outfit. And I got this, I believe in a size large. I think this came in a size large. So yeah. All right, so this is my next outfit. Um, it's just a regular white tank top. I don't even know where I got this white tank top from. I want to say I got it from this, um, where I work. There is a little boutique inside of the um, office building that I work in. I ended up picking up this white bodysuit because I needed another one. And I thought it went perfectly with these paper bag faux leather um, pants that I got from... I believe I got these pants from New York and Company, actually. Um, they are ankle length. Um, like I said, they are faux leather. They're supposed to have this paper bag waist, but the paper bag, the waist part isn't so paper bag. Not as paper bag as I would like it to be, but it's still a cute little fit. It comes with a faux leather belt um, that I just kind of just tied and left hanging. Um, this is how they look in the bag. But um, I really do like these pants i think that they are super super cute i think this outfit is very cute and casual but still dressed up in a way um but yeah these are cute i think i got the pants in a size large and of course like i said i got the um white white beater <laughs> the bodysuit in a size large as well and i do like how they fit everything fits very 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 nice you can't go wrong with a white top and black pants. Like you just, you just cannot. In no, in no, no matter the season, at all. So yeah, that's that. All right. So the next item I have is this lime green sweater. I know that it is bright, y'all. You ain't got to tell me. I know it's bright. But it's fall, and typically you don't wear lime green items in the fall. But I mean, I don't have to live by anybody's rules. And so I like this bright sweater and I think that it is very, very, very cute um, to wear in the fall. It's definitely gonna draw all eyes on you. You're gonna get the attention when you walk into any room with this sweater on. I love this big collar. Um, well, it's really a turtleneck, but it's huge. It almost looks like a like the cow neck, but it's a it's a it's a turtleneck and it's a huge turtleneck. So you definitely have to be careful not to get um, makeup on it ladies and gentlemen um but yeah definitely be careful but i love it um it has the balloon sleeves as well you probably see it a theme i've had but it's probably the fourth item that i've had with balloon sleeves i love a good balloon sleeve especially by ladies who are like self-conscious about their arms um the balloon sleeves kind of hide that um, but I think this is very cute. I just kind of threw it on again with the same bag pants that I had on before. Um, I just kind of threw it on with that. And I really, really like this sweater. I think it's just so cute. Like, I love that it's bright. I think it goes well with my black nails. I just think that this is so stinking cute. Like, very, very cute. Very warm. I also got this sweater in a size large and I bought it from that same boutique that I was telling you about um, with the previous white bodysuit. So yeah, we'll get you a little lime green in your life. I probably won't have this item or the white bodysuit link below because I'm not even sure if they have an online store and I don't even remember what the name of the store is. And I hope that after the pandemic that store is still there because I like to frequent that store on my lunch break at work. So whenever we do go back to the building, I hope that it's in there still. But yeah, anyway, this is the sweater. So yeah. All right, y'all. So I had to come back on a whole nother day to finish this video. Only because my angle wasn't right whenever I recorded the last part for the Ivy Park pieces. So we're just going to do this all over again. All right, so this is the next piece I have, which is the Ivy Park. It's a sports bra. It's supposed to be like medium support, 
Only thing is, is I got it too big. So I do have larger boobs and I thought that it just wasn't gonna work. So I tried to size up to accommodate for my cup size. I shouldn't have done that. I, I went up to a size extra large and I could have definitely stuck with a large um, because it's just big right here on the sides. Like I have extra space right here on the sides. Overall, I really, really, really like this um, sports bra. It's just ill-fitting. And so it just doesn't do anything for me. I love the bag, it's mesh. It has the zipper closure, which I do like. Um, which gives it a little bit of extra support with the zipper closure and then it has like a fasten in the middle of underneath the zipper. So it's a clasp and then it zips. I mean, it's perfect, it's cute, but I just can't keep this sports bra knowing it doesn't fit for the amount that I paid. And I think I paid, I paid $70 for this. $70 it needs to fit so that I can wear it. Because I know that if it doesn't fit, I'm not going to want to wear it. And if you guys hear that squealing and barking in the background, that's my puppy Nico. Um, he just had surgery today. And so he doesn't want to be in the other room. So let me just get through this so you guys can't really hear him. But yeah, so this is the sports bra. Right, on to the next item. All right, so this is the next piece. It is the bodysuit from, well, one of the bodysuits from the collection. I got this in a size large, I think. Um, I think this collection is the Degrassi. Anything that's this color green, I think it's called Degrassi. Um, but I really, really like this bodysuit. It is a little tight on me, but I'm hoping to be losing <laughs> a couple of inches, so it should fit eventually but I really 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 like it it's um it's really really nice only thing is is I have no idea what kind of bottoms I'm gonna wear with this so if y'all have some ideas of what kind of bottoms I can wear with this because I didn't get any bottoms from when the when the line dropped everything all the bottoms were sold out so this was like the only two things that I got so I have no idea now that I done got this, what kind of bottoms can I wear? Like, so I have it pulled down just so you can kind of get a feel that it has this um, lime green stitching right here around the leg part. It does snap in the middle. Um, the sleeves are mesh, mesh see-through. The ivy part is stitched in light blue. Um, and then it has the lime green around the sleeves and around the collar. You can either wear this all the way zipped up if you like, but it's kind of tight and choking. I don't know why you would want to wear it all the way zipped up. Or you can, you know, show some of your collage if you would like. Um, this is the back of the bodysuit. I really, really like the bodysuit. I think that it's cute. It's stylish. I love the puff sleeves on it. I just have no idea what kind of bottoms I'm going to wear. Of course, I wouldn't wear it with these gray sweats. But this is just what I wanted to throw on so my lower region wouldn't be all exposed on the camera. But this is the fit. So I do like the Ivy Park collection. As you guys know, it is going to be dropping um, the black drip or black pack or black something. It's going to be coming out, I think, on the 18th, 17th, maybe. Maybe it's the 17th um, of November. So... If you are interested, it's all black and it's gold, black and gold. And I think that is like the perfect colorway, like for the collection. And I really hope to get some of that. I hope to get at least some bottoms from that collection. So that is all that I ended up getting um, from, from my latest haul. If, you, if there was something in there that you liked, um, let me know down in the comments. Um, I can tell you my favorite items were... I think definitely this faux leather puffer coat. Oh my God, my favorite. Um, the peachy nude bodysuit from Zara. This bodysuit from Ivy Park. And I think that might have been my favorite items. I don't know. But if there was something that you like or didn't like, just leave it in the comments below. And that is it. And until next time, I will see you guys in the next one.